Cucumbers are a popular salad vegetable that thrives in gardens. In comparison to tomatoes, the plant's roots are shallow and require frequent watering. Cucumbers need high quality nutrition to grow properly. Now I'll show you what has proven to be the best natural fertilizer for cucumbers in my experience. And I also use it on tomatoes occasionally. I make a solution from two ingredients. First, I add one liter of milk to the container. Then I add 10 grams of dry yeast. I thoroughly mix everything until the yeast has dissolved. After 10 minutes, I transfer the milk yeast solution to a bucket of water. The total volume is about 15 liters. Every two weeks, I water my cucumbers and tomatoes with the prepared mixture. If you only have yeast-free milk, dilute it with water in a one. One ratio, cucumbers are fertilized every two weeks. It may seem strange, but milk contains a variety of nutrients required for plant growth, including nitrogen, potassium, calcium, phosphorus, and trace elements such as magnesium and sulfur. These nutrients are required for numerous plant functions, including photosynthesis, cell growth, and flowering. In contrast, yeast contains proteins, vitamins, and beneficial microorganisms like fungi and bacteria, all of which can boost soil fertility and plant health. When used as fertilizers, yeast and milk both help to increase the organic matter content of the soil. Organic matter improves soil structure, moisture retention, and nutrient availability. It also promotes beneficial microbial activity in the soil, thereby improving nutrient cycling and overall soil health. The nutrients in milk and yeast encourage vigorous plant growth, which results in stronger stems, more leaf production, and faster fruit development. This can lead to increased yields and better quality produce. Lactose in milk repels certain pests, making it a natural insect repellent. Furthermore, the beneficial fungi in yeast can assist plants in resisting pests and diseases. Milk and yeast solutions improve soil quality by increasing beneficial microbial activity. This increases soil fertility over time, resulting in more sustainable and productive agricultural practices. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, and click the bell icon for future videos.